Montana. He's been on the run for nearly a week. Now ex-LAPD officer Christopher Dorner is facing murder and attempted murder charges here in Riverside County. KMIR 6's Angel Monroe was at the press conference in Riverside today. Joins us now with the details. Angel. Well, the massive manhunt for Christopher Dorner continues across Southern California and other states. Riverside County's district attorney says filing murder charges now allows Dorner to be apprehended anywhere in the state, country, or out of country. Christopher Dorner is now charged with shooting three officers, one fatally, in Riverside County last week. By both his words and conduct has made it very clear to all of us that every law enforcement officer in Southern California is in danger of being shot or killed. Investigators say Dorner shot Officer Michael Crane at a red light in Riverside on February 7th. An 11-year veteran of the Riverside Police Department, Crane is survived by his wife, 10-year-old son, and a 4-year-old daughter. We will sorely miss him, and we recognize that uh, uh, the void that, that he leaves in the department is nothing compared to the void that he leaves for his family. Officer Crane's partner was also shot in the vehicle. So he's in a lot of pain. Uh, he's going to be facing uh, probably many surgeries in the coming weeks and months. Dorner is also accused of injuring an LAPD officer in Corona and of killing a former LAPD captain's daughter and her fiance. He was trained by us and we're pulling out all the stops. We have a unified command with several uh, partner agencies and we're looking for him. Our goal is to apprehend him as soon as possible. Security is even ramped up for this press conference with several blocks of downtown Riverside shut down as well as armed officers at the front of the district attorney's office. We need all of the public's eyes and ears in assisting law enforcement in apprehending this very dangerous individual. Police set up a command center, a tip line, and a million dollar reward is on the line to lead to the capture of Christopher Dorner. Officer Michael Crane's funeral service is scheduled for Wednesday at 10.30 a.m. at the Grove Community Church in Riverside. Back to you, Gino.